god. Oh, that Whoa. lunge. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> that was in the air. Dude, we both did air parries at the same time, and oh I countered your parry god. with that shit. <laughs> yo, yo, got another one for you. It's been a minute, but I'm back in it. What's going on, y'all? It is Vinny. If any of you are new to this channel, hello, and welcome to the KB community. For those of you who've been with me since my last how to, glad to have you back, and uh, yeah, we're back at it again. Just got a few things I wanted to say before we get started here. First of all, I need to say thank you. Thank you guys so much for all the support you've given this channel so far. The last time I actually uploaded a how-to video was back in November. At that time, we were just hanging around 100 subscribers, and now, three months later, we're heading towards 600. It's crazy. I enjoy making these videos, and I'm loving the positive comments and feedback letting me know that you guys are getting some good value out of this. I've also been making plans to get involved with Twitch, and to start looking into other games to play in addition to Battlefront 2. So I'm still going to be playing this game a lot, and I have a lot of how-tos that I'm still planning to make. But if there are any other games that y'all are into, feel free to let me know, and I'll see what I can do as far as getting some different things on my channel. Real quick, I wanted to give shoutouts to both Cortex Zero and Taco. They indirectly helped me put this video together by just playing with me. And I was able to get a few clips with some good examples that I can break down for y'all that you're going to see shortly. Cortex I actually met for the first time not even a week ago. He actually helped spectate one of my tournament matches. He's a more laid-back gamer, but he also likes to do podcasts as well. Taco is the one responsible for hosting all of the big 1v1 tournaments that some of you have probably seen on my channel. Pretty soon here, if I get enough support, I'm planning to start my own 1v1 tournaments as well. Alright guys, let's get right to it. The main topic we are going to discuss for this video is how to block while your character is in the air, and also effectively parry while doing so. As far as I'm concerned, because I checked, this is the only Battlefront 2 video that talks about this. And I think that's awesome because I just discovered how to counter the jump attack. Let's get it. Ben made it inside, I'm playing. Oh no, he's spamming me, why? Aw, uh, here he comes for me now, cause they're like, Vader on me. Yep, yeah, just run away. He's got no stamina, he's low, dude. Yeah. Uh -oh. He's uh -oh. dead, yeah, I'm pushing this. Right, I'm yeah. hopping down the middle. Yeah, without Anakin, we can try to kill him quick. I pulled, I pulled, I'm freezing, I'm freezing. Nice, they're all freezing. Nice, nice. Hey, I'm still on Finn, I killed yeah, Finn. I'm about to kill this Ray, she's dead. Yeah. I'm on the Anakin right now. Admiral says, you guys talk about blocking in the air makes me want to not come back to the game. <laughs> yeah. Like, I have no Poor idea Admiral's over here, like, done. rethinking his entire life. Like, the fuck, dude? Yeah, that, that, really, that really shouldn't be a thing if you're really thinking about it, but it's whatever. Well, it's... I just have experience with that. Like, let me, uh, game, let me show you the blocking in the air thing. In this clip, you're going to hear me break down the basics of how to block in the air. It's a really easy and simple concept to grasp. Literally, all you do is hold block, wait until your opponent attacks you, and then tap the jump button while you continue to hold block. Something I'd like to note though is that the only way you can get airtime and continuously launch yourself off the ground is only if your opponent is spamming you. You can still pull this maneuver off if they aren't spamming you, but you'll have to take a different approach that I'll go over soon. For now, you can see how it's done. Yeah, I want to yeah. see this. Yeah, yeah I'm so, very curious. It's to see it's this. not necessarily like this. Like that's not gonna work. What I mean, so um, just like spam me, like just yeah. I think Whoa. if this, I think if this game <laughs> had a. Like just, yeah. What? what? I think Whoa! If this, I think if this game Oops. had a block, you see it? Stamina, Are you just holding it and jumping? Yeah, I'm just he's holding just it and jumping. jumping. He's That's just it. Jumping carefully, faster than just blocking it. Always doing it. It's not. Yeah. It's good. It takes time to get used to. But I don't think once you get it down, it'll be pretty. That's why it's, it's not like if you're up here, like it's too late. You can't. But like. Okay, yeah. Are you, are you spamming <laughs> it? Or, or are you no, just I'm just- popping? I literally just hold the black button and then just tap the the jump button. So yeah. Oh, like, oh, okay. So it's yeah. a little hop. Like just That's how again. I try to do my strikes. So I just like, I do, I do that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah go ahead and spam me again. Alright. Oh, wait. Ah! Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Okay. <laughs> Alright, hold sorry. on. <laughs> Alright, go ahead. Are you- so you can jump while blocking and you'll still You block? can block while oh jumping. Oh my goodness, kind of. yeah. Yeah, look at that. You're hopping yeah. and blocking. I got it. Are you- So you can jump while blocking and you'll still 
Yeah. yeah, look at that. You're hopping yeah. and blocking. Now I'm going to show you some clips where I just hopped in HVV and practiced blocking in the air. I think seeing it a few times will help give you all a feel for how it should look before you try it yourself. The goal is to not take damage while doing this. Oh! I'm not really concerned anymore, bro. Whoa, that was cool. Wait, hold on, hold on. I think I figured something out. Wait, do that again. Spam me, spam me, spam me. Like I mentioned before, this is more of a flashy move and it's better used in specific situations. So if you're going against more than one person, from my experience, you should just stay on the ground. Oh my god. Spam me. Sp oh, you gotta keep spamming me, bro. You guys are trying way too hard. It's annoying, bro. But, like, you're not even good trying too hard. So, it's like, it's even more annoying than that. I guess the part that's annoying is that you're not good but you're trying and it's like dude i could destroy you right now but you're not even like you're not even worth me going that hard on you and this guy's over here trying to push me and it's like dude can you get the fuck off of me bro hopefully you guys understand the basics of just blocking in the air but i would recommend getting some practice with it if you're still confused about it okay so now that we've covered blocking in the air we're gonna go over air parries if you're watching this video right now I'm going to assume you already know how to parry. However, if you don't, that's fine, because I do have a how-to parry video that breaks down tapping, which is the beginning stages of parrying. So I would check that out first, and then come back. For everyone else, take what you know about parrying on the ground, and then just do that while your character's feet are off of the ground. If it sounds easy, it's because it is. But of course, here are some examples of what I mean, and then we'll talk about it. <laughs> And here's what air pairs look like from the other perspective. Order's combat system okay. would work perfectly for Battlefront. Oh, there you go. Oh, there you go. Oh, wait. There you go. Oh, and I did yep. parry. And you parried. Yep. See. Wow, that is cool. Like I think I killed you with uh with that on one of our duels uh, yeah. back on uh, the first. I yeah. yeah, I kind of yeah, like yeah. hopped up and then did like a double. Your spam me, Taco. I'm gonna try to concentrate fire on him. Whoa, oh, Benny with the second win. All right, two oh, of any monsters. Hold us up. Yeah. Like I said, it's just flashy, like um okay. the worst thing you can do really is just like try and parry them back and then you end up like getting hit, but uh, like if you just hop up, I mean as long as you're holding black you should be fine. You know about the walkthrough, Taco? Oh wait, hold on. You're parrying? Yeah, you can parry in the air with it. Like um, start swinging at me, I'll just try to like do it. Yeah, just keep swinging. You see that? What? Wait, wait, wait let me try. You saw that? How like I jumped up and parried it? Yeah, yeah you can parry yeah. in the air. Yeah, so I'm gonna just spam you and then you can like just time it. So like, do the same thing you would do when you parry, but just jump. So I'm gonna start spamming. Oh. Yeah, you saw it? Yeah. That makes sense. You wanna try, bro? Yeah, sure. Nice, nice. <laughs> nice. Alright. I'm gonna spam you and then you can try it. There you go, you just blocked in the air, you saw that? 
All That's right, like another um, thing I know. There you saw it guys, that's pretty much the basics. Now we're going to go over how to make this a more viable move. By the way, thank you to everyone who was with me during my live streams when I went over the air parries. You guys are literally the reason I was able to get these clips to make this video. I really appreciate you all. Uh, I'm trying to think of anything else. Like, so you know um, how some Vaders, when you're playing against them, they'll like, they'll do one swing and then they'll do like an upswing. If you don't know what the upswing is, I'm talking about this. Okay. Right, you're just gonna trade that, dude. Right, you're just gonna trade that, dude. Like, so you know um, how some Vaders, when you're playing against them, they'll like, they'll do one swing and then they'll do like an upswing. When I mentioned Vader in this clip, I was referencing the double parry. For anyone who doesn't know what that is, it's when you bait your opponent with a fake swing, or one that you don't intend to do any damage with, and then immediately follow that up with a counter attack. And here's what that looks like. Ooh! Yeah. I think that works for everybody. Cause you can like block in the air with that, so like if you're parrying. I'm basically trying to show you that one way to make air parries more effective can be to set them up after a double parry bait swing. I used Vader as an example because he is tanky, so he won't be punished as much for messing up an air parry as opposed to someone like Darth Maul or Yoda. Here is a clip of me trying to hit a double parry setup to an air parry on Luke, and I was trying but it was just not going well for me, I was not having a good time. <laughs> He's so annoying, bro. <laughs> I know. It's like I want to trade with it, but at the same time, I don't really want to trade with it. That's a play. All you do, Leia, is just shoot my block. Oh, wow. Yeah, Yeah, you see it? Oh, right, here we go. Yeah. If you guys look at my stream, you can see my energy. And, like, I have no stamina either. Actually running down. Yeah, I don't have any now. <laughs> yeah, I see him. What the fuck? Do they use your blast during the first fish? Bro, I don't think that'll connect. I think you're lagging just a little bit. Alright, the next thing I want to talk about, or should I say reinforce, is why it's not the best idea to try and parry abilities. I'm going to show you clips where some things worked and others didn't, and I just want you to put perspective on this when you watch it. When you're watching these clips, ask yourself, was it worth it going for the air parry, or should I have just stayed on the ground? Maybe not. Perfect. All right, all right. What the? Oh my! What the? Oh my! Oh my! Oh my God! Stream. That was good. That was good. 
That combo was, uh, yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, fuck. All right, nice. I'm good. Oh, yeah, no, okay. Nice. Oh, nice. Oh, fuck. All right, nice. I'm good. Oh, yeah, no, okay. Nice. Fuck. I keep timing that wrong. It's like I do it at the last minute wrong. Fuck. I keep timing that wrong. Like, I do it at the last minute wrong. One thing I was able to test out though is that you can still incorporate your abilities into combos right after an air parry, and that seems to be a lot safer than trying to parry your opponent's abilities in the air. Here are some examples of that. Alright, that works! Alright, that works! In this clip, we tried to see if Kylo could air block to a freeze, and he did it successfully without taking any more damage than he already had. I'm still trying to perfect the ability aspect of this maneuver, but the only thing I know for a fact is that Kylo's freeze can be inconsistent if you try to do it this way. Try using your freeze as you're up in the air. Maybe you can like do an ability combo off of that, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, yeah, go ahead, Taco. Like a, like a block air pull or freeze? Whoa! <laughs> Hold on. Dude, you know what? That's the that first time we've seen that. That's the that's first time I've seen that. Pretty, so maybe, you can set that up cool. on purpose. Maybe you can't be cool, dude. They're all the jump block. Like I'm just like low on stamina back in the corner. Someone's doing that. Just like, if somebody else makes a video about this, y'all know where it came from. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. I might, I might have to make yeah, one. Just, yeah, look, 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 look <laughs> at the dude who's my found. Oof. Come on, bro. No. No, 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 no. Oh, that's a kill! Oh, that's a kill, oh, boy! Wow. Let's get it! GG! <laughs> oh my gosh. Should I use Grievous for I don't use Grievous for 1v1s. I don't know. Just for the practice, I use Grievous. I don't usually use him. Hey guys, hope you're enjoying the video so far. Just wanted to make a quick announcement. We have a Discord server now, but I wanted to give a big thank you to the one who made it, one of my subscribers, General Grievous. He's a mod for the channel now, he's been a huge help, and he's the one who actually created it. He's done it all by himself. It literally would not be up and running right now if it wasn't for him. So I really appreciate you making that for me, man. If you're listening to this, I just wanted to tell you that again. I know I've already told you like 8,000 times. <laughs>
Anyone's free to join the Discord. Console, PC, doesn't matter. It's made to help bring the duelers in the Battlefront 2 community together just so we can get more access to tips and tricks, ask and answer more questions, and it could be a good way to get connected with better players so we can get some more competitive duels going. Since, you know, EA doesn't have private matchmaking available. So if you guys do want to check out the Discord, the link should be down below. And if you've learned anything new so far, or if you're just enjoying the video, help support the channel by leaving a like, commenting down below what your thoughts are on this new hidden mechanic, and consider subscribing. Just remember, your support will allow me to continue to make new how-to videos like this and expose more of the tips and tricks that I still know. Thanks guys, really appreciate you. Now let's get back to it. Alright guys, so far we've really only just gone over the fundamentals, like blocking in the air, air parries, air parry setups, and ability combos. The first half of this video was the informational part, and now we're going to see how I put these techniques to use during my duels. And on top of that, I'm going to demonstrate how to shut down the advanced jump attack. Or some of you guys like to call it the hook slash. Either way, it's my best move. I like to put like, people's abilities stuff to you, like skill wise, and I still gotta get better at it. Yeah. Air parry. Knew about that. Knew about that. Got him. Oh, oh no! Oh, oh, what? what? <laughs> Got him. <laughs> no? No! Go away from me. <laughs> Alright. Oh, okay. You're lucky. Oh. You're really lucky. Uh, Air parry! Let's get it! Oh my gosh, oh. you're gonna die. I'm gonna kill you, bro. That's a hit. That's a hit. Oh. Appreciate it. GG. Oh, Hey, Do you have uh, a clan? Yeah, I'm part like, of uh... a. <laughs> yeah. Let me choose Dooku. Yeah, the hit registration, really, that's me walking into their body. Like, I'm getting specific angles on them. I just realized how hard I am. Why is everyone always a Michael Beck's coup? I've been putting together some clips for you guys, uh, for one of my how to's that I'm gonna be releasing shortly. I think you guys are gonna like it. Trash, no, that's cool. What do what you, uh. About? What are you doing the how to on? Um, how to black in the air. Really? Yes, sir. Nah. Hey, yeah. Air yeah. parries, boys. <laughs> no, no. Just uh, no. Vinny School of One v One. That's how you parry in the air. Just uh, letting you know. Damn it! It's gonna push. Finishes with a jump attack. Oh, there you go. Oh. Yes, sir. That's a GG. Oh, I hit a thruster, Damn, bro. All right, let me back out. You know what? I don't. I don't know if you've ever done this, but have you ever parried a jump strike with a jump strike? Yes. Yep. It's fucking insane. Yeah, it's it, it's pretty uh, it's, it's pretty rare. crazy. Yeah, <laughs> it's hard to do that consistently. Oh, I just blocked an- I just blocked- Anakin. Yo, did you- Oh my god, I'm gonna have to run that back in the stream. I blocked his jump attack with mine. Oh, I just blocked an- I just blocked- Yo, did you- Good block up. I just blocked it again! What sense do you I play on? I play on uh, Max. Oh wow! For both. For both, yeah. Wow, well, I don't you even could do turn that. your wow. back for like a split second, but just don't like have it out like long enough for someone to hit you. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm stuck in the. Yeah, with sabers and shit. Oh, you're. I know. It's all right. It's because I fucking play Finn and shit. Alright, I just took oh, away health regen, I guess. Oh, I blocked in the air! 
So the jump attack block is only effective if you're like, if they are fully committed to it. If they're just sitting on the ground parrying, it's not effective. Yeah, he just does the same thing. He runs, um, 100-100. What does that mean? For sensitivity? Oh my god, why did he get- <gasps> That's so stupid, dude. I don't know why Wait, does he so run far. like zoom sense too? <laughs> yeah. Oh. He was almost finished, bro. Yeah, see, he's really good at do that again, Spooky. If y'all want to know how to do that bunny hop thing, he's really good at it, bro. <laughs> <laughs>
No, I'm talking about ball. Oh. No. Catch me outside with it. <laughs> I ain't even using star cards to land or right now, bro. Um, You're not running hot and cold? Nah, bro. I'm running his uh, health card. I took all the other cards away. Oh, so you are running hot and cold. Yeah. I guess I am. Let me just, I'm gonna just play aggressive against, uh, I can't even speak. Aggressive. Kill at this that point. <clears throat> I don't have anything to lose. I'm gonna just use this to find a... Oh, man. Find a new way. Let's see. Who you use? I need to worry about, like... Cause I'm just playing, I guess I'm not really like worried about dying, I'm just playing. So. Right. Look at this parry master, bro. Jeez. Am I dead? Yes, sir. Wow. <laughs> you did a full circle, bro. <clears throat> Alright, let's get him. <laughs> wow, oh, no, I messed it up. Nice. Damn, Starks is a parry master, bro. Okay, all right then. Yep, right here. Oh, you're lucky. Oh, nice. Yeah. That's permanent. <laughs> so you guys, if you, uh, for those of you watching the stream right there, that combo I did just took away permanent health from him. <laughs> nice, that's fine. I just blocked in the air. You see, the blocking in the air is actually worth it, I think. Bro, you have potential. Yeah, you did not fall for those, like, at all, dude. That was, like, good stuff, man. GG's. He's not bad, huh, Batman? He's, he's not yeah, bad for his first month, dude. Well, I used to 1v1 Vinny a lot. That's all good. Not so much anymore. <laughs> That was weird. Okay. That was weird. Okay.
Gotcha. Oh, yep. Oh damn. That nice jump attack. Holy fuck. I just I started telegraphing his movement over time, and then it just built up. Those air carries. Oh, please kill him. Please. Alright, ready? <laughs> Stay alive, Batman. <laughs> you just gonna wait it out. <laughs> I, I could just hold block like man and a boo boo, nana boo. <laughs> 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 oh my god, that's twice in a row. Oh my god, that's twice in a row. Please don't jump attack me. Even still. Hey, when I What's that? 15, we're gonna jump him. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh <laughs> shit, okay, never mind. Cut that time in half. Yes, sir. That was an extended jump attack. I know how to do what that. Happened? I. He didn't think I could reach him from that range because I extended it. There's a way to do it. That's stupid. Yo, where's space at, bro? That pretty much wraps it up for this video, y'all. I really hope you enjoyed what I put together. The concept of blocking in the air was something I found out about during the fall of last year. I just hadn't mastered it at the time, nor did I have any clips that proved I knew how to do it. If you learned something new that you believe could benefit you in Saber Combat, or if you just enjoyed the video, Go ahead and leave a like. Tell us down below what your thoughts are on air parries. And if you'd like to see me upload more how-to content like this, consider subscribing. Like I mentioned earlier, the more support I get for this channel, the more time I can put into making new content, which means more videos sooner. I'm looking at your comments, all the people who have asked me for a specific video, I'm either working on it currently, or I don't have enough clips to begin working on it yet. Once again, y'all, thank you all so much for your support so far, and for those of you who stuck it out to the end of the video, I appreciate you watching. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Benny out. Oh, I'm dead, yeah. I probably shouldn't have swung there. Oh, he's toxic. He's being toxic. <laughs> it's all good. Nah, let him, let him uh, choose Luke again. Yo, I like how you use that. Like playing ring around the <laughs> Yeah, he always does that. Oh, you okay. what? what happened? You right. teabag Benny, I teabag you, motherfucker. <laughs> thank you, bro, thank you. All right, but he's he, he wants to spam, right? So okay. <laughs> Vinny, is that okay? Are you going against you, man? Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Mm, All right. Hold on. Let's go!